From strategy to brand positioning, design to websites, and ultimately social media, we're able to create something unique that our client loved and we're really proud of. Based out of the beautiful Hunter Valley, Shaw and Bunner are an outstanding personal injury law firm. They've had long-term connections to the local community and in particular, the local mining community. The problem the team identified their branding never reflected any of this. Like lots of law firms, Shaw and Barna started out with branding that did themselves. They created the website, they created their own logo, they did it all themselves, and they really didn't have any kind of strategy behind it. They just got on with the work, which makes complete sense. When you're starting a new business, to put your head down, make sure it works first, and then look to invest in the things that you value more down the track. Essentially, they recognized pretty fast that their positioning was a little bit off and they needed to do something about it to take the business forward. The first step in helping them like the first step in helping all our clients is to really understand the brand and to get the brand positioning right. I think that once we had been operating for the few years it was actually a really good time to do it because we had learned more about the business about how we wanted it to run how we wanted to work best for our clients. Ultimately, without the right positioning, you'll never get the right results with your design or website because all the decisions are driven by that brand positioning, whether it's design or copy. We wanted to do the deep dive into why we started the business in the first place. I think when we started, we thought we'd have time to do that and things just got moving so quickly that we didn't really have that time. So yes, we had a logo and we had a website and we were off and running, but we have never really taken the time to dedicate to actually working through like the values of our firm, our brand, what we wanted to be known for, but moreover, how to best articulate that. Once we nailed down that strategy and positioning, we're able to start the process of creating great design. Their old black and white imagery looked really polished. It looked very professional but it wasn't very approachable. And it certainly wasn't going to appeal to their key client. Ultimately, we wanted to communicate their great legal skills, their experience, their connection to the community, and the fact that they were connected to the industry as a whole. After some iteration, we landed on a logo, color scheme, and imagery that was way more reflective of who they are and what was important to their clients. While we were happy with what we came up with, something was missing, and that something was extra design assets that tied everything together. We wanted to create some fresh, purposeful icons that were representative of the brand. So internally, we started to throw some ideas around looking at local fauna, looking at flora, looking at mining equipment and everything in between. But ultimately, we came up with this open cut mine idea. This piece was really the cherry on the top for us as a team. It was the piece that brought everything together. It was stylized, it was connected to community, and it really worked for them. With the branding in place and all the imagery and a real sense of who they are and how they sounded, we were able to start building the website. Like with all our website builds, we started with a blank piece of paper. We like to design sites from the ground up in Figma so that they're exactly representative of what the brand is all about. We don't like using templates because ultimately they make you make creative decisions that aren't absolutely in line with how you wanna communicate. Our clients don't like clone sites because they want to stand out as themselves. So while this process takes more time and a lot more work, this means we can build a site that truly communicates our client's strengths. It was really exciting to see it all come together. In particular, the website was great. That's kind of, when we started the process, the website was what we really um, had focused on in terms of needing an update and it was both visually really great but also we were really happy with the copy and how that was put together. In the end building the website was very straightforward because everyone was on the same page from a positioning, language, brand identity and brand design perspective before we started. 
but we weren't done yet. Sean and Bunner do a great job on social media. So we created a whole suite of social media templates that they could use on Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, and their blog to help promote the business. Now, getting this right is really, really important because you want consistency across all of the touch points your brand will have with your audience. Really, our, our team love it. So we were involving them in the process a little as well when we get um, different options sent through and, and they really love it. I think externally, clients yeah. seem to like it, um, family Perfect. and friends. Yeah, we've had feedback from other businesses, things like that, or we, we touch base, people that saw posts on LinkedIn and things like that, oh, I love your branding. So yeah, we've had great feedback yeah. across the board. This really was a great project for us. The client identified that they wanted to step up. They knew where the problems were with their brand. They just needed some help getting there and they needed our creative input and expertise in helping them each step of the way. Thank you, Sean Bunner, for the opportunity. And if you're looking to elevate your business's brand, we'd love to chat further about it.